Hey everyone, this is Yan from Devolutions with this week's Remote Desktop Manager Pro Tip. As IT professionals, we're often faced with a situation where we have an upgrade on a computer or a server or even a laptop, where we have to migrate data from one to the other. And we know that takes quite a bit of time as a IT professional. There's tools that we can use to make the process easier. So I wanted to share with you today a quick little tool we can use in Remote Desktop Manager to copy your configuration file and export it from one computer to another so you can save all of the relevant information, your data sources, so you're up and running as quickly as possible. So let's take a look at my screen. So here you can see my Remote Desktop Manager in a dark mode. This is the RDM configuration that I want to export. So I got a bunch of different data sources. I've already got things set up the way I want them. So I want to export this and I wanna import this into a brand new uh, remote desktop manager that I just installed. So I'm gonna to go to File, Options. I'm gonna go down to the Export Options button here. And now you'll see here all my export options. So here are the things that I'd like to export. Now, obviously, if you are migrating this to another computer that's a different user, you're gonna have to pay attention to your settings because there's some things that you don't want them to have. But since I'm the user and I'm just upgrading to a new laptop, I'm gonna go ahead and include everything. So if I include these data source uh, credentials, I'm gonna click OK, and then I make sure these are all of the uh, data sources that I want in there. So I'm gonna click Export and it's create a brand new package. I'm gonna go ahead and save this into my OneDrive. So I'm gonna select uh, config files. I'm gonna click save. And now the file has successfully been generated and saved. Okay, now I'm gonna head on over to my other laptop and I'll be back in just a second. So here I'm in my brand new instance on my laptop of Remote Desktop Manager. It's fresh, there's nothing there. There's, there's just my local data source and nothing else. I'm gonna go on File and I'm gonna go down to Options. And in my Option Windows, I'm gonna click Import Options and it's say Import from a free edition or a different file. So I'm gonna say Import a different file. It's gonna say what file do I want? Well, here's my OneDrive that I already have it saved here. I'm gonna click Remote Desktop Manager .config. And then this window is gonna pop up and say use a selected configuration file as a new one or choose options to replace. Well, I'm gonna use a selected one and it's gonna create a backup just in case I made a mistake. So I'm gonna click apply. It's gonna prompt me to restart the application. I'm gonna say okay. And now it's loading back up here. And now it loaded up and it even kept the dark theme because that was saved in my old file. And this is a brand new installation on a new laptop. Uh, I've got all my data sources. It's already configured exactly how I want it. And I'm ready to go. So as you can see, it's really, really simple to export uh, remote desktop manager uh, configurations from one computer to the next. And we provide you with a ton of different options that you can select depending on your environment. As always, if you need help with this process, make sure you refer to that help file below or contact our support department. They would love to assist you in any way. If you like these kind of videos, make sure you like and subscribe to them so that we can keep providing more content just like this one. Thanks again and have a great rest of your week.